Hey, I am at Six Flags Magic Mountain again. Last time I was here, I got on Goldmine, Goliath, and Twisted Colossus. So if you want to check out me getting on those rides, then just click on here in case you want to know what those rides are about. Today, obviously, I'll get on something different, and I can't really tell what it's going to be while I'm recording this, because you never really know what's going to be open here, how long the lines are going to be. So um, let's get on some rides. Well, here is Revolution, one of the oldest rides here. I haven't been on that one for a while, so let's get on it now. Fun fact, Revolution was the first roller coaster in the world to have an upside down loop. Back in uh, the 70s, I remember when I first heard that roller coasters went upside down, I worried if people were gonna fall out. I wonder how they stayed there. Of course, as I got older, I learned about centrifugal force. How do you, did I say that right? Oh, it's a bit of a line. Oh, well. Wait, I will. Hey, do you Six Flags veterans remember when uh, Revolution had like VR goggles? <laughs> yeah, I had to wait really long twice to get those goggles and both times it didn't work. And they gave me like a fast pass or whatever, but didn't really help. Anyways, I'm glad it's over. Revolution is actually a great coaster by itself, so. Well, I'm finally here after 40 minutes. Um, you don't get to choose your spot anymore. I find that kind of annoying. I don't mind waiting longer so I can be in front. Being in front is the best. On there. Well, here comes the train. It is going to be my turn very soon. Okay, well, I'm getting on, so let's have a fun ride. Oh, this is super fun. Oh, now we're going to go through that one loop. There it is. There it is. Well, Revolution is a great ride. Don't think that because it's old, it's not worth being on, but I just waited like 40 minutes for it. Try not to wait for it so long. So definitely get on it if the line is short. Okay, well, here's a sign for X2. Is X2 open? Probably not. Uh, let me take a look. Okay, you know what? Never mind. Um, I just checked the app and it said it was a 130 minute wait. I don't have much longer here. I can't have a long time. I've got a show tonight. What show, you say? I am in the musical Hunchback of Notre Dame. Okay, it's a small part, but it's at the Nocturne Theater in Glendale. Okay, so right next to X2 is Viper, another old roller coaster. Maybe that'll be the theme for today. The thing about Viper is that it opened in 1990 and its big thing was it had multiple loops. Oh, copyrighted music. Okay, well, the line doesn't look too long. Anyway, what was I saying? Yeah, it opened in 1990 and the big thing was, wow, it had multiple loops, which is like no big deal right now. But back in 1990, it was something special. Okay, barely any wait for this one. So hopefully it's good. An old deep and a goodie. I mean, there's a reason why it's been around for so long, right? Wow, I forgot how much fun Viper is. That, I mean, just because it's an old roller coaster doesn't mean it's bad. It's still kind of smooth and the loops are just, ooh, I don't want to die. The loops are just awesome. Okay, well, how about one more coaster before I have to go home and get ready to go to the show, okay? Haha, <laughs> Tatsu. Bet you it has a long lineup. I need to get on a ride now. So gotta go home. So, so far when I get into line to get on the roller coaster, the attendant places me in a row. Um, the only place that doesn't happen is on Twisted Colossus. And I hope they keep it that way because I love being in front in Twisted Colossus. 
Okay, so one more coaster. Um, let's check out Apocalypse. Looks like they're getting ready for Fright Night, which is going to be happening in a few weeks. Here's Apocalypse right there, so hopefully there is no line. Don't expect it to be. There usually isn't. Okay, I'm not the biggest fan of Apocalypse because, I mean, first of all, it's a wooden roller coaster. But what I don't like about it is that it's really, really shaky when you're on it. Um, there's this guy online who said that it was better than Ghost Rider. Better than Ghost Rider? No, I don't think so. Well, here is the lineup for Apocalypse, which, fun fact, used to be called Terminator the Ride. I guess that explains it's uh, kind of a cyberpunk look. Wow, I don't even remember all the theming. I haven't been to Apocalypse in a while. Well, Apocalypse didn't assign me to a line, so I get to wait for the front car. Okay, I am getting on front row seat. Okay, you're gonna see what a rough ride this is. Oh. Oh, okay. Apocalypse was a fun ride. Is it as good as um, Ghost Rider? Nah, but it was still fun. Super shaky though, that's really irritating. If you don't like that in coasters, then you won't like this one. Okay, anyways, that is it for me. Um, I am going back home, so I hope you guys enjoyed riding some coasters with me. I am the BBG.